that policy changed in Ontario, there was a crazy rush of, they call them like wind cowboys. Right. So they would then come and get a, get farmers to sign an agreement that you know yeah. they had the rights to develop the wind there, sell that agreement off for a bunch of money to someone else who was actually going to build the project. So windfall profits uh, because of that policy. But it'd be interesting to, I don't have that the answer in terms of how to do it, but it'd be interesting to look at like how do you do, how do you get entrepreneurship going in this area? Can you do it with local entrepreneurs? There's there's some problems there. Ontario also had a local manufacturing clause uh, that if you were going to be in the beat in tariff program, you had to get some of some portion of your stuff built in Ontario, and it got overruled by the WTO. They had to, to 